there before we start the video I just wanted to let you know that if you see anything in this video that you really like you can go to metallicamom.com google it type it in whatever you need to do and then once you get to metallicamom.com if you don't see what you're looking for all you have to do is hit that little button on the bottom right corner and you could chat directly with me anything that you type in there it goes right to my cell phone talk to you later bye bye I don't have any lipstick on but for some reason uh, my lips look like magenta Maybe I'll try to fix the color uh, once I'm editing this video. I am done um, stopping myself from making videos of myself because I haven't put on makeup. Like, I'm just done with it. Um, I, I, I got real sick last month. I'm not going to get into that again. And my outlook on life is a little bit different. And so if you are put off by my appearance, then fuck off, okay? And I know that all of you are gonna be like, what are you talking about, whatever. I have not been making forward-facing videos, like front-facing videos, videos that I show my fa myself in a long time because I had this like image in my head of, first of all, I have gained a little bit of weight, uh, whatever. Um, I mean, I'm not ridiculous you know, um, but whatever, um, I'm, I'm not exactly in the place that I want to be, but again, whatever, let's say it again. And also like makeup isn't as important to me as it used to be. And I, I, I don't have the time for 27 minutes of me, you know, doing liner and stuff. I basically have mascara on and a little bit of brown here, brown, and a little bit of eyebrow. And that's it. Oh no, I did do a little bit of, of blush, whatever. And I'm a little red because I promised myself that I would be walking outside, being outside, being underneath the sky as often as I possibly can after being in isolation for 10 days in the hospital <laughs> because I need fresh air, I need outsideness. Now I'm not a country gal in the slightest, like literally at all. My parents moved to the Catskill Mountains in New York when I was 12 years old. And I booked out of there about five minutes after I graduated high school and moved to Midtown Manhattan because I like the concrete. I don't like the country, okay? But when I say I like the outsideness is that I, I like the fresh air and stuff like that. And I like fresh air so much that I can't, like I don't vape, I can't be around smokers. Um, I do like the smell of exhaust, ironically enough. I'm so off topic. Um, anyway, I'm not giving a shit about my appearance anymore. So whatever. A box came today, ding dong, the witch is dead. The witch is not dead. Uh, ding dong, a box came today and I opened it up. I'm like, what the hell is this? It turns out that because I registered for Sensi Family Reunion ver Vertical, virtual, they sent us a bunch of stuff. I got the email last week and I was like, oh, isn't that so nice? Because they told us that there wasn't going to be any freebies. When you go to Sensi Family Reunion, which is the annual conference, when you go there, you go home with a ton of stuff. In fact, you have to be very careful about how you pack to go because you're going to need room for all the stuff when you get home. Oh, my God. When we went to Anaheim, I literally packed, and I'm so glad that I did this. I had a huge suitcase. It was the director luggage. Yay. Um, I had a huge suitcase, and then inside there I had put a small duffel bag and that's what I, basically all of my stuff was in and then on the way home I had to check that suitcase and it was full of product warmers buddies wax testers catalogs this and that blah 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 so when you go to Sensi Family Reunion the annual convention you go home with a ton of stuff and for those of us who only did virtual they were just like no we're not going to be giving anything but they did they sent us a bunch of stuff I don't know the scent descriptions of anything, but I will show you everything. I haven't even taken it out of the box yet. All I did was take out the um, packing material, you know, to keep it down in here. I don't have the scent notes. I don't even know exactly what's in here. I don't remember what was in the email, what it said in the email. Laundry liquid in, oh my God, I can't see that. Fluffy fleece. Okay, I, I'm hoping that that says fluffy fleece. I might be able to see this one a little bit better. Yes, so I got laundry liquid and a little thing of washer whips and fluffy fleece. If you're familiar with fluff, if, you're, if you are familiar with fluffy fleece, 
that means that you might have purchased a brick last Christmas season. They had five bricks and one of them was fluffy fleece. So I'm going to smell this now for the first time, although I warmed through a brick of fluffy fleece. These washer whiffs don't smell very... Oh, yes, there it is. It took a second for it to hit my nose. Okay, that smells very nice. Um, they took away windowsill breeze, I think, which was is a bummer. Um, so this will replace that, I guess. They always have like five to seven fragrances in the laundry line. So I don't have the big tub of it. I have a little one and I have, they only make one size of the laundry, li laundry liquid. So there's that. Vanilla Mint Counter Clean. Fantastic. I love Counter Clean. In Vanilla Mint, though, I'm surprised that that came back in cleanser, cleaning product, because it's not in the wax, I don't think. Anyway, um, and then in here, I'm assuming is a couple bars of wax. I think I remember that from the email. Sorry about the noise. And an ice pack. They changed the company that they either get the ice packs from or the the way that the company makes the ice packs and now they're like cloth on the outside which is really nice i guess so that it doesn't sweat kind of like my face anyway and so i have three bars of wax here which i again i don't have scent descriptions for because i don't have it would be nice if they had put a catalog in here but that's okay i'll be ordering catalogs on july 1st black currant and plum i almost dropped it very pretty Nice, a little light. Pop it out of the clamshell, you can smell a little bit better. That's nice. I'm looking forward to uh, warming that. That is fruity, but not like fruit punch, which I appreciate. Oh my goodness, Velvet Moon? That sounds like it's anime or something, right? I love this color. Oh my God, it reminds me a little bit of Quiet Grove. This is a little grayer than this. This is a little bit more purple. Oh, it's powdery. Um, might be completely different when I warm it. It smells like it wants to be a very light perfume, like almost baby powder kind of a thing. I'm not sure. Perfect day. Pear like, um, like the pear. Hi. Hi. Love pear, and I love this. <gasps> Great. This is, oh, this is really just pear. There, if I read the descent description of it in a week or whatever, it's going to say pear and blah, 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 and meandering through the wandering woods and blah, blah, blah. It smells like pear. I love it. And it also doesn't smell like rotting pear. There was a couple of, a uh, couple of times that they made pear that was really disgusting. I'm like sweating my ass off. This is so nice. Oh, okay. So I'm really excited. I got these not for free. Scentsy Family Reunion virtual. Scentsy Family Reunion this year was $150. And for a lot of us, we felt like, why bother paying that? Okay. I paid it because I am a leader in the company. And a lot of times leaders in the company will say to you, if you have one person under you, you're a leader. You know, um, whatever. And I do believe that also. But I wanted to make sure that I was up on all the things. And then I ended up not participating in Sensi Family Reunion Live at all. And they still haven't to this day, I don't think, posted any of the video that they were going to record and then put out. <laughs> so I did not participate in anything in Sensi Family Reunion, unfortunately. It was my kids were still in school, which is why I didn't go. I probably wouldn't have gone also because of my health issues from May, from last month. So I probably would have ended up canceling anyway. So it's all well and good. I'm going to go next year. Next year it's on the East Coast. I've got my, my Carolina girls that I'm going to be seeing. They know who they are. Um, I'm even thinking about driving because it's only like nine and a half, ten hours, something like that. And this way I will have my car there, my Ford Flex, my Metallica my Mobile, and I can uh, have a little bit more freedom when I'm there. So I might be driving down, which I don't know, maybe, maybe not. I don't know, whatever. But anyway, I got three bars of wax. I got laundry detergent, laundry liquid. I got counter clean and I got a little thing of washer whiffs. And um, 
I'm happy that I spent the 150. I'm happy that I um, got this, and um, now I can hopefully at some point sign into my workstation and watch some of the video from Sensi Family Reunion. And I also saw all the snapshots. Like everybody who didn't pay the 150, you didn't get this stuff, but. All the things, sorry, all the snapshots were on all over Facebook, you know, so next year will be different. Talk to you later. Bye.